Okay. Let's do this. Investigation time. Oh god, it's left. Thank Hey, bitch. After a certain amount of time has passed, the class trial will begin. Uh, oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh god, Nicomar, you're dead. I guess a violent shiver coursed through my body. My heart began to pound faster and faster. So, uh, I don't hear anything. Oh, really? Yeah. You sure? Is it not? Is it's it low really volume? Quiet for some odd reason. I hear it, it's just that- Like, I, I have to put it all the way at max for the, uh, the- Ah, uh, I see. Actually, let me double check my settings. Uh -huh. No, no, like, it's- it's- it's work- it's like that for me, too. I guess it's just low uh, volume on neutral side. Oh, here, I can, uh... Like, if the strawberry door has a lock on it now. <laughs> for whatever reason. How's that? My ears! Ah! Uh, no, I'm kidding, I'm good. What? Is, is that better to go? I'll, I'll make it work. Okay. Mm -hmm. My heart began to, to pound faster and faster, and I could feel the blood in my head pulsating intensely. My teeth were chattering for What the hell is this? When I was finally able to speak, my voice sounded so small I could barely hear it myself. <clears throat> because they're starving to death. Uh, but why? Why is this happening? It's so strange. He, he finally came back to us. If this is a nightmare, please let me wake up. I wake me up. Think of wake any way to start it. Can't wake up. Uh, Can't wake up. Save me! <laughs> Nicomar! No. This is all a lie, right? This is just... Uh, uh, situation. The body discovery announcement. It's unfortunate, but there's no doubt that another killing has happened. Killing? I can't deny the truth, but why? As usual, that was the only word I could squeeze out. Hey! Hey, what happened? Akane! Move! Move! Move it! Akane pushed me aside and ran straight over to Nikomaru. Why? Why is Nekomaru? Why did he have to die again? Damn it. I never paid you back. I never paid you back. For your help last time! I feel something warm against my head. I swear to god, it's a Hofumi thing. <laughs> okay. Is there a Hofumi thing, yeah? Yeah, Sue! <laughs> yeah. Damn it! How cruel! I knew it! This is just too much. Why did why did Nekomaru have to die? Though his appearance was drastically altered, he still came back to us. Oh. Why? Why does this always happen? No matter how much I try to stop it, this is always the result. This. There's something they can't stop? Damn it! Hey, Nekomaru got killed, right? That announcement means that... I think... What I think it means, right? I won't forgive you! Hey, who did it? Who killed Nekomaru? Maya! Looks like someone is finally pumped up. You. Y you Hey, you know who did it, right? Who killed Nekomaru? Don't get mad at me all of a sudden. In fact, I'm the one who should be mad. I went to a lot of trouble to bring Nekomaru back from the dead, and he already let the killer break him. <laughs> How disappointingly foolish. Maybe he had a few screws loose. Oof. You know, because he's a robot. You talking about Nekomaru? Yes. <laughs> Agune, calm down. Phew. I'm not killing with my tits! <laughs> Use those powers that your anger has awoken for the investigation. Um. Um. Nekomaru? Uh, Is there no you can pick Nekomaru? Oh, Monokuma. Hmm. 
Hey, Nekamara, fix yourself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's really hard to do. Four arms and hands. Oh, no. Hey, you have one arm. That way it's not attached. Uh. <laughs> hmm. I could have fixed him if his head was still attached, but since he's like this, it's, it's impossible. Plus, the last time this happened, it was my fault. But this time, the killer is the one of you guys. Yep. And I'm under no obligation to fix him for you. I guess it was a waste of time to ask him. In other words... A life that dies once will never return twice. That's reality for you. So... So, even though it's getting a little boring, let's go on with the usual routine. It's the Monokuma Farm! Uh, it, bitch! <laughs> no, no! Also, this is a gift from me to you. Red bean bread and milk! Wait. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, some... That's, that's the finally, exact... some good fucking food. That's the same food, okay. <sighs> I brought you guys a present since the killing went off without a hitch. Besides, <laughs> if I don't feed you, you guys probably won't last enough for a class trial. Damn it. I'll definitely find out who killed Coach Nekomaru. I won't forgive you. And after I kill that guy, you're next. I'll definitely destroy you. So even though it sucks, I'm gonna eat first. If I don't get some food in me, I can't unleash my full power. <laughs> you're right. If we're gonna avenge Mekamaru, we gotta regain as much energy as we can. Damn it. Damn it. I'm gonna eat. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh. Uh, take the wrapper off first! What? <laughs> Man, this really sucks. I was just about to invent my new signature move. Necromizing Beam! <laughs> Come on, Hajime. You too. We both have to. Moe Yagate. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> I've been waiting to eat bitch. something for so long. Damn it. I never expected I'd feel this terrible when I finally ate again. Hey! Hey! Eat it slowly. It'd be bad if you get a stomachache. We all ate our food in silence. Slowly, my blood began coursing through my veins. Wait! They got food? Oh shit, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. yeah, he gave them, yeah. I started to slowly regain feeling in my numb body. Whew. Isn't that wonderful? Man, finally some good fucking food. <laughs> Looks like you got your energy back. And let's hurry up and start already. It, 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 does everyone in the Danganronpa universe, like, are they able to survive after days of starvation with only a bun and, like, milk? I have no idea. Because the same happened to Naegi, and he got he, he got the exact same thing. Yeah, <laughs> I, I remember that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do it! Yeah, but after you, like, the fake execution. Yeah. Thing. The killer and you. I'm gonna. Oh wait, there's one dialogue skip because I didn't read it. Never mind. Oh 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 oh! I skipped one. Yeah. Oh okay. Yeah, no, okay, she said. I'm gonna do it. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. I thought you wanted to skip that one since she said it. Nah. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. The killer and you. I'm gonna beat the shit out of both of you with my bare hands in my breast. However, <laughs> um, regardless wait. of whether we so start or not. Yes. Oh, I, that was improv. Sorry, I was tapping away. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, that doesn't sound like a Kane. I mean, she would let somebody touch her boobs in a way. That's true. She, does, she doesn't care. Yeah. Anyways. What has happened to the others? They appear to be extremely late. You mean the guys in Strawberry House? Now that you mention it, no one's here. Hmm. That's weird. They should have come to Great Tower because we had Monokuma Tai Chi. Unbelievable. Jeez, how unacceptable. I never expect all of you to ditch Monokuma Tai Chi, honestly. It was way beyond my expectations. What are you gonna do? Well, since it's happened anyway, I guess it is what it is. Everyone ditched? Everyone Does ditched. everyone include us too? Do your best. <laughs> Now do your best to investigate. I'll see you again at the class trial. Trial. Somebody messed with the clock. Dot dot dot. Hmm. I hear. I hear something. Um. Ah. Uh, what do you hear? Huh? <gasps> Could it be Nikamaru? Damn it. Of course not. He's already dead. Dot dot dot. Yo. Oh well. Now it's not the time to worry about that sound. 
that sound. What are you talking about? I don't hear anything. Um. And what about Gundam and the others? Is it alright that we have not some of them here? <laughs> They're gonna come here anyway, soon anyways. Now it's not the time to worry about that. them. You're right. They should have heard the body discovery announcement already. They'll probably come soon. Maybe. Yep. Maybe. I think we should start the investigation soon. Yeah, you're right. It's time to more your uh, day. God! Oh my god, neutral, I swear. <laughs> I gotta do it. I have to do it. And oh I just I just realized what you did just did. Yeah. I did it twice. Gundamu! <laughs> Gundam! Nekomaru! <laughs> Nekumaru. <laughs> oh my god. Nekumaru. Oh my god. I think I think I think the actual hero this time is gonna be <laughs> Never mind. Okay. First... We already got a Gundam in here. Yeah. <laughs> We're a legit Gundam. Yeah. yeah. First I need to look at the Monokuma file. Somebody fucking died. <laughs> he just doesn't show where he was struck, he just was dead. The dead. victim is Nekomaru Nida, aka Makamaru, after his robotic transformation. I didn't know he was so tall. Uh, Big. Oh my god, yeah. Six foot four. His body He's was like, covered in know, great power. Uh, it's like, you know, Jotaro. Yeah. Big. His I mean, his outfit almost looked like it. It does. I don't know. Which is inside it's... the funhouse. His head is severely damaged and beyond repair, so that shall be considered the cause of death. Hmm, so it's not absolute. <coughs> Despite that fact, his arms and legs are dismembered. Oh, there it is, okay. These looms are actually designed to be detachable, and it seems they separated due to severe impact. Aside from that, several other areas of his body are damaged. Because They're of this, dead. many of his functions seem to have shut down. So he's dead! <coughs> his arms and legs were detachable. It looks like they separated due to severe impact. Does that mean Nekomaru was repeatedly clubbed with some sort of weapon? But was there a reason they needed to club him over and over again? Maybe. Hmm. It looks like the hammer from like Smash, so it, like them just like hitting him with the club. It's just, like... <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> they just boing on onto the screen. Boing. Hey, Akane. Did you find anything? Is that I'm not a bitch. Mmm. M's. <laughs> Looks like you haven't found anything yet. Leave it to me! We need clues, right? I'll remember something, so just wait for it. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like that's gonna be a little hard. Yo! Oh, I remember. There is something I thought was weird. Um, it happened early the, in, in the morning. You're going back that far? Like... Come on, you know it too, right? You heard that rumbling sound? Rumbling? Kablam. Kablam. What was that sound <coughs> just now? Was it Game. an earthquake? <laughs> but I did- Oh, I just realized what you meant! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> the, the, the Smash the, reference. Yeah, GAME! <laughs> After the oh. Kablam. <laughs> but I didn't feel the ground move. Hmm. I guess I'm just thinking too much. Um... I was sleeping pretty heavy, so I wouldn't think about how hungry I was, but that noise woke me up. Huh. I ran out of my room without thinking, and after I did that... Then what happened? I didn't see anything either. Looked like the others didn't come out of their rooms either. I felt pretty dumb for being the only one who came out, so I went back to my room and fell back to sleep. Hearing a sound and walking out of your room and seeing no one else come out is like just kind of scary to me. Booga booga. <laughs> In the end, I never found out what that sound was, but it's been on my mind for a while. You no, know, now that you mention it, it does seem strange. Just what was that sound? Hmm. Huh? You don't know either. Well, I should tell you in more detail. When I ran out of my room, I happened to glance at the lounge clock. I, it said it was around 5.30 a.m. Will you be able to find out anything with that info? I didn't think that rumbling noise happened that early in the morning, but I'm not really sure if that noise pertains to the incident or not. Hmm. Why? What the hell? I went to, into the trouble of remembering that and you got nothing? Jeez, you're so damn yes! 
She seems agitated. Well, it's understandable. Take my take my truth bullet. Akane's entire face has been added to the truth bullet. Thanks. Why not my titties? <laughs> huh? Huh? What's this? Did you find this... something? Well? Um, under Nekomaru's body. No, wait. There's small rock-like fragments underneath Mekamaru's body. You didn't correct yourself like that. You didn't need to correct yourself like that. Uh, what do you mean rock-like fragments? See? Here, look. There are a lot of these small fragments. Just like they fell under Mekamaru's body. Well? Oddly enough, though these fragments are underneath Mekamaru's body, there are hardly any on top of his body at all. That's stranger. What's strange about that? Is there a problem that they're not on top of his body? Yeah. Maybe. Yep. You don't know, it's okay. It probably means they're not that important. Well, if you put like that, now I can't help but think they're important. So that means the pillar fell first and then Nakamura got killed. Because I thought the pillar dropped on him, but if they're under him, then that means he fell on them. Hey, Sonya. I see. I um, see. In this case, what. I mean, this case is Monokuma file. There's no written time of death, right? Didn't that happen when Ibuki and Hyoko died too? Oh, did it? But the reason the time of death wasn't mentioned uh, when those two died was because the time of death was the key to the mystery surrounding their murder. Could that be the case this time too? Um, by the way, I would like to confirm this just in case. Um, Ultimately, is it safe to assume that Great Tower and the Strawberry are the same building? Well, that's the only thing we can think of. Even when we experimented with Jeffy's handbook and left him in Great Tower, he still showed up in Strawberry Tower. And over your monopad. <laughs> Which means? Which, the reason each tower's wall has different colors is because the floor lighting is, ch is changing the colors. The reason Usami's floor portrait is different in each tower is because it's merely a projection. Yeah, that should be the case. Then... Then it is decided. The two towers are the same building. Which means the scene of the crime is simultaneously the Grape Tower and the Strawberry Tower. Grape Tower and Strawberry Tower are the same building. How does that pertain to Nekomaru's murder? Hmm. It does! <laughs> oh wow. I can look up really far, I just realized. <laughs> I could see you, Hagi, man. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh god! Oh god, not the, not the sword! <laughs> An enormous hammer has been carelessly left on the floor, like a pickable <laughs> item. It's like, it's suspicious because it stands out so much. I'm imagining the hammer from Smash. Yeah, that's what I mentioned, yeah. yeah. It's exactly what it is. <laughs> Perhaps that, that hammer is the weapon that, Neko, that broke Nekomaru. I do believe a weapon of that size is capable of damaging Nekomaru. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> this hammer is the weapon? But it looks a little too clean. It's almost like it's new or something. It is strange, no? Also, where did the killer obtain this hammer? Prior to now, I do not believe I've ever seen an object like this. Was it hidden somewhere? Good point. There's no supermarket here. I wonder where they obtained it from. What is a hammer? Uh... I've never seen an object like this. <laughs> Smash! <laughs> Now we put the hammer down! <laughs> <laughs> the pillar next to the door is tipped over and broken. Did this pillar break when it fell over? Maybe. Not just that, there's a strange liquid in the upper section of the pillar. Is it Nekomaru's oil? This is the only pillar that's tipped over. The other one's still standing. I guess, I guess you could say it's now spoiled. Cut. <laughs> Plus behind me is the door to Great Paul. The two pillars on each side of the door haven't changed either. They're not tipped over. Where the hell are the other boys? Hmm. I'm they're, too. they're on, uh, Strawberry. Yeah. Yeah. That's that. Oh, yeah! Mm -hmm. There. It's strange that this pillar is the only one that's tipped over. It might mean something. Huh. Why the fuck does this look like Pepto-Bismo? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of Pepto-Bismo do you drink? I don't know, man. I see. I got it. G got what? Leave it to me! This pillar is the weapon! The killer used this beat up Nekomaru. Great observation. This, this huge pillar. Damn it! Have you ever played Smash? <laughs> if you got sucked by something like this, even Coach Nekomaru wouldn't wouldn't stand a chance. Yeah, well, that's impossible. 
They, it'd be too heavy to wield his weapon. Now then. Hajime, grab that, grab that end over there. No, huh? I'm gonna do it. We have to try it out, obviously. Come on, hurry up. Fine. Jeez, you're more forceful than usual. <laughs> he's, he's barely touching it. <laughs> I know, right? It's no use. It's barely budging. Didn't I tell you? <laughs> All right. If that's how it's gonna be, my body can take it. Power times three. Oh my god. <laughs> no, seriously, just give it up already. Oh, Ka Kaioken. Oh, Ka Kaioken. <laughs> it's no use. It won't even budge. If two people can't get, uh, can't even move this pillar, then it's impossible to use as a bludgeoning weapon. Well, there's only one person who could have lifted something like this. Robo Coach Nekomaru. It's definitely the only one. Hmm. Robo Coach. The silver pillar has been added. Hmm. Wait, illustration. Wait, what? Oh, okay, oh, okay on the floor. Okay. Yeah, the uh, floor. Mm -hmm. Time to respect the body. <laughs> it's cruelly broken. Yeah, it's so much detail that you have to take a closer look at it. It looks like it's been severely damaged that even its head was dented. That would be the fatal wound, right? But Necromaro's robot body should have been durable enough to withstand any assault. For Nekomaru to be this damage, it can only mean whoever attacked Nekomaru didn't hold back. Hmm. That's probably not the best time to think about this, but I guess it's, I guess it's time to check and see where all the tea came from. <laughs> I guess Nekomaru really was transformed into a robot, huh? I was getting used to the idea, but now that I think about it, robots are definitely unusual. Well, it doesn't matter if it was a robot or not. Either way, Nekomaru was still killed. Mm. <laughs> it's definitely strange, isn't it? Hmm? What is? Well... If they wanted to kill him... They could... I just realized... Oh yeah, blood power went to bed. Okay. If they wanted yeah. to kill him, they could have just destroyed his head. Why did they destroy his entire body, too? Yep, he also said he wasn't feeling well. Oh, okay. well, yeah, but he, uh, he said he probably wanted to fight you. Um, oh, well, it's up to you. Uh, maybe they didn't know how to kill a robot, so they damaged him all over. You! But they went against Coach Nekomaru. He ain't that type to die easily. What's that mean? They obviously didn't fight him head on. But even then, he would have leave him. He wouldn't leave himself open to attack. You're right. In fact, that's the biggest mystery. Nekomaru was even stronger after he became a robot. Can't think of anyone who'd be capable of killing him. Anyway, this alone isn't enough information. I should investigate a little more thoroughly. I'm the guess of guy a little more thoroughly. Oh. Okay. I'll, I'll I mean, the cable. I I know it's <laughs> I know it's a robot, but this is actually if this is a person, this would be a really brutal murder. Yeah. 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 That's yeah to be honest, yeah. it, 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 I guess I I believe it's like originally Kodaka's idea that somebody would be brutally murdered like this, but they were like, okay, maybe this is too extreme, so fuck it, let's just make it a robot. Yeah. Well, they're pretty strict from how they do censorship in Japan when it comes to blood and gore, so yeah. this makes sense. I think in a fan game, they did it. They did it something like this, Oof. where somebody got decapitated and shit. Oh, mm -hmm. I couldn't handle that. There's a sturdy, there's a strutty metal wire tied to Nekomaru's left leg. Did they misspell that? Huh. What? Strutty? Str yeah, strutty. Just pronounce it as sturdy. Okay. There's a sturdy metal wire tied to Nekomaru's left leg. The same wire is tied to his arms. It's almost like he was bound up or something. But even if they bound him up, the killer still had to deal, uh, deal with robotic Nekomaru first. Who did this, and how were they able to buy Nekomaru? Also, the tip of this wire. It looks like he's been tied into a loop, but... What was the point of this? Um, I forgot this game does actually have typos, so... Mm -hmm. It's rare. It's yeah. really rare. Yeah, that's okay. I mean, I mean, there's a lot of the dialogue, so yeah. it makes sense. It, I believe it's also randomly generated. Well, not randomly generated. It's generated on the fly, you know? Oh. So, I believe that can also happen. 
So he got tow cabled. Interesting. Uh, the cover of his chest is open slightly, but it won't open much more because the cover's all messed up. If only Kazuichi was here, we might have been able to open it. Jeez, what that could be? Uh, what the heck could he be doing right now? Sleeping. <laughs> huh? And dying. There's something protruding from behind Nekomaru's neck. Is this? That's right. It's a cutting edge function that puts my other functions to sleep, even if I have insomnia. Just press the good night button on the back of my neck, and I'll be forced to enter sleep mode. Where can I buy one? <laughs> it hurts so much to like see him alive and then see him like this. Yeah. Maybe the killer pressed the button and made Nakamura enter sleep mode. But still, it's hard to think that the killer was able to easily press a button on the back of Nakamura's neck. Even if Nakamura was ambushed, it wouldn't be easy. Good night, button. Where can I buy one? I need one of those. <laughs> There's something it, it, protruding from behind Nakamura's neck. Oh well. Okay. Oh. Yeah, it's the same thing. It's, it's kind of... Just the blood itself. Just the fact that, uh... Oil. Yeah, and it's like the same color as the blood <laughs> in this game. Fucking Pepto-Bismol. Um... I knew it, he was... <laughs> That's why he couldn't shit! It's because of the Pepto-Bismol! <laughs> <laughs> he and... didn't have any inside of him! Oh, God. This fluid is flowing out of Nakamura's body. Based on the smell, it like seems like oil. It seems to be flowing heaviest from Nekomaru's head. Probably because that's where the fatal blow was dealt. Surprise, Jackie hasn't tasted it. Mm. <laughs> Stop it, Connor! <laughs> oil for Nekomaru. This might be similar to normal blood in humans. Which means all this oil is just a pool of robot blood. Anyway, that's a whole lot of oil. It's not going to be easy to clean up. No, now's not the time to even worry about that. Are you sure about that? I think I have to remember this. Oil on the floor. I guess for now, this is all I can do to investigate Nekomaru's body. I will miss his bolt. <laughs> Same. I don't know anyone this one. <laughs> exactly. Oh my god. Okay, uh... Okay. I believe there's one more in here. Oh yeah. What is this? The door at the front back has a chain wrapped around the doorknob. It looks like a sturdy metal chain. It's wrapped around the doorknob from every direction, and it even has a padlock on it. Why did they do something like this? With a twist! Um... Alex? No! You're the you! I think he lagged out. Uh, Give him a second. Uh -huh. oh. Oh. Hey. He's coming back to us. Mm -hmm. mm. Perhaps this... Perhaps it just is an alternative to open the door with the key. Uh, if that's the case, you wouldn't be able to enter this tower from Strawberry Hall from the Strawberry Hall side. After all, this door should lead to Strawberry Hall. You are right. If they barred this side of the door with a chain, it would have been impossible to open it from Strawberry Hall. But still, why would they need to bar the door to Strawberry Hall? Sorry about that. No, that's fine. fine. I barely heard it. Uh, hmm. I guess for now, I've checked out everything in this place that caught my attention. Uh, 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 what is it? You seem lost in thought. Mm. Oh well. The final dead room. The final dead room. What the so, heck? Why are you bringing up that place all of a sudden? Well, why are you bringing up that place all of a sudden? So, oh, the hammer at the floor. It chained after on the door at the far back. And the wire that tied up Nakamaru. All the evidence that this crime scene consists of things that were never seen inside this building, doesn't it? And as long as we can't leave, then there's no doubt that they came from somewhere within this building. So that's why it, so that's why you mentioned the final dead room. Monokuma said beyond that room there's an ultimate weapon in a place called the Octagon. Yep. Yeah. So if we think about a place like that, like an armory, then that's where the killer obtained their tools, right? Then if so, let us go confirm it. No, that's dangerous. If you go in there, you have to play, you have to play the life-threatening game. Well? I'll be the one who tries to confirm it. Huh? What are you saying? You were the one who said that place was dangerous, right? You? Man, it's noisy. I can't focus all, at all with all this noise. Sorry. It's not 
not like that. <laughs> it's not you guys. There's a sound that's been ringing since before the investigation started. Really? Buzz, buzz, buzz. Since before the investigation. But Celeste, get out of here. <laughs> that reminds me. You've been mentioning that sound for a while, haven't you? Hey, hey. Fucking hey. What kind of sound is it? Um. Sounds like Amber Lillard. <laughs> it's like this high pitch alarm clock sound. It's probably ringing from upstairs. Maybe it's better if we go check that out. Uh, check, 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 check out that sound first. No, 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 no. Hmm. Are you gonna go check it out? Then you guys go. I, right. I'll stay here. Then I shall wait here as well. Please be careful, you two. Maybe. Sonia's okay, but how come you're not go not going? No, 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 no. Hey. The hell, neutral. You all right, buddy? Yeah, I don't. Yeah, sorry. You can't read. Well, that sound is annoying, and I don't re really feel like leaving. Hey, hey! Hi, Jamie. It's okay, it's just the two of us. Come on. That's the two of us. Akane said she wants to stay here. Huh? Hmm. Oh, I get it. She, she doesn't want to leave Nakamaru's side. I don't know if she's actually aware of that or not. Yep. Let's They're go, dead. Hi, yeah, if you say so. But mm -hmm. the twist. <laughs> I should get out of here for now. Yes, I say to myself as I walk up through. Hey, you thirsty? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Always watching, Hajime. Always watching. <laughs> Always watching. Yep. Now that we've come all the way here, I can definitely hear something. Oh, jeez, it's so annoying. Yep. It sounds like it's coming from the floor above us. What could it be? Yeah, you can... Oh, barely. God, I hate this. It's so I freaky. Can barely hear it, but, yeah. but yeah, I know. There it is. Try the door, the phone. Or is it? See? Jesus. Can't so open your mouth. It looks like that phone is ringing. Phone, huh? I guess I'll answer it. Chucky. Hey, hey. Answer right. the goddamn phone. See? Oh, <laughs> Let's see, just pick up the receiver and press the strawberry button, right? Click. Oh, damn right! Oh! You finally answered! That voice, is that you, Fuyuhiko? Jeez! No! Jeez! <laughs> Do you know how long the phone was ringing? <laughs> it's getting worried that no one would pick up! Is it becoming a thing where Fuyuhiko says jeez all the time? Like, like... Hey, it's soda. Okay, interesting. Well, what are you guys doing? Are you all still in the strawberry house? Like... If we want to go over there, we we can't. Looks like someone broke the damn elevator. It's not moving at all. We may can't enter the tower from Strawberry Hall because the door button there is broken too. <sighs> so basically, we're sitting ducks in here. <laughs> not only is the elevator button broken, but... The strawberry hall door button is broken too. Hey, bastard! Hey, are you listening? Y yeah, I'm listening. Anyway, everyone in the strawberry house is safe, right? Well, we're safe, but we can't find Nekomara anywhere. Do you know anything? Didn't you hear the body discovery announcement earlier? That's what it was. Shit! Why did it have to be Nekomaru? He just came back to us! <sighs> Where was he killed? Great Tower. When I went there this morning, he was already... I see. <sighs> I see. Great Tower. If the door to Strabay Hall wasn't broken, we'd be able to enter the tower and... Holy shit, that's it! The killer broke the elevator and the strawberry hall door! So they could split everyone up and prevent us from doing a proper investigation! Dumbass! Damn it, that dirty bastard! What about the other way? 
Is there any other way you can get? Yeah, yeah. Is there any other way you guys can come to the side? Well, yeah. I guess we just have to let Kazuichi handle it. He said he'd take care of the elevator. I guess he's our only help right now. Help! <laughs> you just hear Nekomaru on the other line. <laughs> no, it's Nagito. I mean, I'm Shut up, Nagito! Nagito. You're Nagito so so. goddamn annoying. Why didn't I tie you up? I, I, I'm out of it. I'm sorry. You're right. It's fine. Besides, if he doesn't stand out now, where the hell will he? When the hell will he? Right? Like, based on what Kazuichi said, it's gonna be hard for him to fix the strawberry hall door without parts. But he said he might be able to do something about the broken elevator. The smell elevator. <laughs> we'll be waiting. Are you guys going to be okay? Damn right. Yeah. Well, right. Head right over as soon as Kazuichi fixes the elevator. Until then, it's up to you bastards. Click. Hmm. Hey, hey. So the call came from Strawberry House? Apparently, the others can't come over here because the elevator is broken. There's no doubt that this is the killer's doing. They prevented the other from coming to the crime scene. As long as the elevator is out of commission, those guys won't be able to investigate. But that's not all. For some reason, even the door button to Strawberry Hall is broken too. Huh? <sighs> Sorry. The door button to that's Strawberry right. Hall? Um. Then that door... Is blocked from both sides? There's a skirting chain tied around it from the inside, and the button is also broken from the outside. Then, yeah, that seems to be the case. Mm. Why did the killer need to block both sides of the door? I'm not sure, but there's something strange about that. Um. I would like to investigate that in more detail, but if they can't come over here, then we can't go over there. I have a theory that it's not the same building. Hmm. Yep. Which means for now, it's impossible to check the final dead room. I'm not entirely comfortable with you going over there, but regardless, it's impossible now anyway. Apparently Kazuichi's preparing the elevator. All we can do for now is put our hope into him. Help! Go Nagito, get out of my brain! Help! Nagito! Okay. Shut up! God! <laughs> I'm not fun. Right. I just wanted to game, Hajime. I just wanted to game. <laughs> but Monokuma isn't going to wait. I doubt we have much time before the class trial starts. I hope Kazuichi can fix it soon, and if not... Leave it to me. It's not that I'm in your brain, Hajime. <laughs> His brain's in him? Ah, <laughs> ah. <laughs> Hey! Hey! Uh, are you listening? Hey, bastard! Hey! Are you listening? Damn right! <gasps> oh my god! Whoa. I know! I'm talking to you! Hello? Huh? Oh my uh, god! Actually, Nitro, you take it. Somebody's calling me. Oh, okay, gotcha. Huh? Jeez! Don't. Huh? Me? I figured you weren't even listening. Sorry, I was just thinking. <laughs> oh my freaking god, what? You're, you're probably thinking of something messed up, weren't you? Yeah. Stupid Making love to babies. Holic. Shut up if you're stupid bagels. I'm gonna put cream cheese over your face and turn you into a bagel and then we'll oh, fry yeah, right your ass. Baby, oh. But <sighs> I have been listening to you. Nekomaru was I killed, didn't... right? I didn't think I'm to die. You could have died first. <laughs> and that body discovery the... announcement was referring to him. Damn it. <sighs> Out of everyone here, it just had to be Nekomaru. Damn it! What he went through to come back to us? Damn it! How pitiful. It's a tantamount to be killed twice. Truly. He was a man burdened with terrible misfortune. Hey! Thank you. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now that we know the situation over here, is it alright if I go ahead and fix the elevator? Yeah, it's alright if we wait a little bit. Before you do that, we should... Did you call for me? Get the Monokuma file, right? <gasps> 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 He's here! Now then, 
It seems you guys have noticed that the incident has taken place. So this is for you. Red bean bread and milk. <laughs> it's disgusting. <laughs> Don't even like it. <laughs> they, they recorded that full line. And there's a bonus item. It's Auto coins. <laughs> no. And this boring piece of e-paper. <laughs> Do <laughs> your best. All right. Come on, satisfy your hunger with this. Into your very best on the investigation. Why <laughs> is the Monokuma file being treated like a bonus item? Yes, it is. Whatever, man, just eat. Eating something should come first right now. Damn right. Yeah, you're right. It's okay if you guys eat, but can you hear me out while you're at it? What do you do? What is it? Well, I was thinking about what we should do and I wanted to discuss it. Even so. Thanks to the killer, we can't even go to the crime scene. We have to wait till Kazuichi fixes the elevator. True. There's no doubt that the killer is responsible. But it seems as though they made a huge mistake. Stop enunciating your words! There's no way the Shimbo of Hope Peak will give up just because of a little setback. There's no way everyone will just cross their arms and wait for the class trial to start. We need to do everything we can on our end to prepare for the class trial, right? Well, yeah. Fine. It seems that we too shall begin the investigation our end. Though it remains unclear how much we can do. This is blowing my mind. <laughs> is this acceptable? If I show my serious side, things will not end with mere child's play. I'm so glad I knew you guys were pumped up from the start. How beautiful. Even though you guys are suffering from despair, I can see that you guys are still fighting for hope. Ah, such beauty. There's no higher honor for me than to investigate this murder with you guys. So, we need to be grateful toward Nekomaru for becoming the foundation for this hope. Can you quit monologuing and just get to investigation? Well, regardless! Whose side should it be on for this case? The killer? Or the rest of you guys? I must make sure if I can face this case's mystery properly if I'm going to find out which side is the true hope. <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> yeah, I'm done. Hey, you guys. Why don't we try arranging the sequence of events in this case? You know, so we can properly understand the situation we're in. Fine. I have no objection. Proceed. And let's look back at what happened this morning. We tried to use the elevator so we could participate in Monokuma Tai Chi, right? Damn right! Since we're staying at Strawberry House, in order for us to get to the meeting spot at Grape Tower, we needed to use the elevator first and go to Grape House. That was before that 7 a.m. Oh, yeah, that was before 7 a.m. Since it was right before Monokuma Tai Chi. Man. But once we realized the elevator was disabled, I seriously panicked. Anyway. Since we couldn't do anything about it, we just... tried to get inside the tower from Strawberry Hall. But when we actually got there, the button on the hall door was broken. Ugh. Thanks to that, we couldn't even enter the tower at all. <laughs> so, Fuhiko suggested that we use the phone and call Grey Pass. This, too, must be the will of causality. And that was everything that happened this morning. I must say, I'm Oh, welcome back, Luke. Please voice Nagito, it just feels wrong. <laughs> <laughs> It feels very wrong. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> I, must say, I must say, I'm surprised. I never expected that the elevator would be disabled. But then, how was Nekomaru able to go to Great Tower? Man. Uh, obviously, he went before the elevator was disabled. When was that? You. Baka, if we knew that, this wouldn't be difficult. Well. No. We might know what time he went to Grape Tower. You serious? Huh? <laughs> Seriously? I... It was around sunrise. That's when I saw him going down to the first floor. What? 
You mean you personally witnessed Nekomaru going to Great Tower? Hey, hey! When was the sunrise? Was it before that rumbling sound? Huh? Rumbling sound? Huh? What? You don't remember? Right after the clock in the lounge started ringing, we heard a rumbling noise. Did that clock even ring in the first place? Hey, hey, hey! You, you didn't notice either? Seriously, stop that thing was super loud. <laughs> huh, that's strange. Hmm, I feel like we're not quite on the same wavelength. Well, if it is what it is, there's no way you guys will ever be on the same wavelength as trash like me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so weird. Hmm, looks like it, this is leading to an interesting development. Hey, Gum. <laughs> Hello. Oh, hey, camera. <laughs> Just ignore his Gundam. <laughs> You're probably on the other side of the security camera watching everything. Even though we're suffering from this here, they're watching everyone fight beautifully for hope. Wow, everything's just tailored to be Nagito now. In a way, I'm jelly. They get to see things we don't even know about. They get to see the full spectrum of hope. It's the motto that they use to communicate with us. How much longer until Monokuma appears on the screen? Until then, we need to collect the clues that will lead, that will solve this case, so we can be useful for the true hope. <laughs> true hope. And truth. The night is my domain. You must have been in a deep slumber last night to not notice the alarm and that rumbling noise. Which room was Nagito bedded in again? Uh, the deluxe, if I remember. All right. All right. <laughs> because he won. He won that rock paper. Yeah, he did. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I see. You must have been possessed by a wandering succubi. <laughs> Bagels. <laughs> For you to avoid being snatched away to the world of dead. <laughs> I knew you had the devil's luck. Well, my luck is only my only good quality. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you say you that you witnessed Nekamara at Sunrise, right? Can you explain that to me in a little more detail? I I was so hungry yesterday that I, I couldn't sleep. I figured it was nearly morning, so I went back to check the clock in the lounge. Turns out I was totally off. It was still around 5 a.m. Hey, oh boy, 5 a.m. Hmm. And that's when it happened. I heard the sound of the door closing off in the distance. <clears throat> when I stuck my head out from the lounge, Ah, I wonder who's thirsty. Who <laughs> be thirsty? Wait, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, hey. What's up? Oh, hey, Yeet. we're playing uh, Danganronpa. Uh, if you wanna listen in? Uh, feel free to, man. Help. Hey. Oh, uh, yeah, it, I know. It, it, because this is the, the, the Danganronpa room. Yeah, yeah, this is for the people. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, let me post it now. Yeah, we'll wait for the door to come back. <laughs> I, I'm about to head out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait for the cool. He's so tiny! <laughs> <laughs> But oh my god, I didn't I didn't expect this. Hi Queen Hito. About to head out. <laughs> See you later, girl. <laughs> and dies. <laughs> he just dies. <laughs> um, I I I didn't expect this case to go this way. I was, I was thinking, yeah, like, how are we gonna do this with just Hajime? But then, like, oh my god, 
This is blowing my mind. Yeah, dude. Oh, man. Because I, I knew Nagito had like a lot of similarities to like, the protagonist figure, but like I did not expect that. Finally, I'm not a protagonist. Dang it! <laughs> One chapter that did have destroyed it all. <laughs> but I was chosen for this moment. This moment Choose me. Protagonist. But that was it. But that was it. Hey, I'm just talking to you. Um, he says he loves every, loves everyone, and blah 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 blah. blah. I hope everyone's have has a good time in Dying Robo. Ah, okay, cool. That's um, it. <laughs> All right, Fuyuhiko, I'm about to head out. <laughs> hey, Fuyuhiko, I'm heading out. But oh, really, Hajime's probably thirsty. You know, <laughs> he sensed the thirst. Wait, level. I didn't get the oh, read that. Oh, okay. I was improving before. Oh, yeah. When I stuck uh, my head out from the lounge, I saw Necromora's back. He was about to go down to the first floor. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, I thought about. Oh man, that red bean bread's good. I thought about <laughs> running after him, but I didn't have the energy, or real power to do it. If I knew something like this would have happened, I would have mustered the strength to follow him. Ugh. Hey, hey! <laughs> but why would Nekamaru wander off so early in the morning? I, I was wondering about that too. I mean, oh, sorry. Sorry about that. I already knew I wasn't gonna g get any sleep. So I just sat in the lounge, stared off into space for no real reason, and waited for him to come back. That'd be such an awkward, like, CG to draw. Jeez. Yeah. What, him sitting? Him yeah, I'm just sitting in the lounge. Chilling. Yeah. Anyways. And that's when the clock in the lounge started ringing. Thanks to that loud alarm, I completely forgot about Nekamaru! <sighs> Till just now. Then, from the time you saw Nekamaru until the alarm clock rang. Hmm. You, you were at the lounge the whole time. That's what I just said, dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> but, what were you doing during that time? That's suspicious. A chance where you're thinking about everything that's happened so far and getting choked up. What? Huh? <laughs> wah wah wah. Huh? <laughs> Was I right on the money? <laughs> of course not, asshole! You're completely wrong! Uh. No, that's wrong. <laughs> Ah, uh, go man say, you're absolutely right. <laughs> <laughs> and I thought you were reminiscing about Peko. You it? shut your damn mouth! You see, if also, this is- If this is- Oh inside my god. Thought. Even though it's an inside thought. Oh yeah. my god. If- If this was Hajime, then you'd say, yeah, you were totally thinking about Peko. But this time, Nagita just believes him. Uh, <laughs> I love the difference between them. Meme, I just yeah, that. I saw that. Delicious. Delicious. I, I remember sending this to you and be like, "This will make sense later." <laughs> <laughs> oh, I remember now. <laughs> Isn't there one for uh, for Naegi too? Just I believe one. so. Yeah. Oh my god. I'll look for it, but not now. Oh man. <clears throat> but that can't be right. After all, you already know what how pointless it is to cling to memories of the dead. Oh, thanks for chewing. <laughs> oh, you want to you want to read the? Oh yeah, uh, bullets. Bang. Ah. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> hmm. I'll wait for Hajime to shoot it. Anyway. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey Kazuichi, if you don't mind, can I can you inform me? The stuff about a rumbling noise and the ringing clock. What was that all about? It's weird. Seen Mu talk to himself. I I'm know. I'm so used to neutral doing it, and this is just. It's so yeah. like jarring. I love this. Seriously, you don't know? 
<laughs> You're so kind, cousin. Thanks for actually taking the time to explain it to me. <sighs> yes. King Crimson. <laughs> Anyways. So, that's how it is. Fine. I'll tell ya. It happened last night. I was sleeping peacefully in my room when all of a sudden I heard this huge sound. It's okay if I turn the music volume down a little bit. It's kind of drowning out me a tad bit sometimes. Huh. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna watch this bit and then when we get to my line, I'm gonna have to actually, like, leave to use the restroom. Okay. okay. Gotcha. I don't want to miss anything. Yeah, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, we are, uh, yeah. Alright, here's sound. Boom! Game! I knew it! Three Hiko is the appeal! Oh wow! Wow! The hecky! The sound was super loud, so I rushed out of my room. Well, why are they showing the flashback like this? This is so strange. Oh god, oh god. As I went down the hall towards the lounge. Hey! What are you doing? What are this you This rock is... It's louder than the supreme ruler of the netherworld bellowing for a sacrifice! <laughs> <laughs> Why does the art look kind of different? He looks pissed off! Yeah, it's, it's like slightly it, different here. It's it's just probably because of the, uh, the location yeah. they're yeah. standing. Maybe. I see mean, swell. Yeah, this is kind of funny. Don't go making all that noise so suddenly. Huh. It, it's not me. <laughs> the, the wall clock just started ringing. I was just trying to stop it. <laughs> then hurry up and stop it already. I, I, I know I'm in the middle of doing that. <laughs> and that's when the sound finally stopped. What the hell? Uh, Man, that totally freaked me out. Well, I'm definitely wide awake now. What did you do to me? That was weird. What did you do to me? <laughs> My mental defenses were bombarded with sonic resonance. <laughs> you! Oh. Fuyuhiko! Was this not your doing? Just now? Shut up! Why would anyone do something so childish? Because you look like a child. <laughs> I'll pull your nutsack off. <laughs> Just That's threatening crazy. Nagito from the flashback. <laughs> you must have rushed over after hearing that sound, but you sure seem to get there pretty fast. Well, yeah. Well, I didn't rush over here. It was just a lounge by coincidence. You fiend. Coincidence. Hmm. I was gonna say that. <laughs> I thought of you and I was gonna say that. Huh? What? what? Do you doubt me? Hey. Whatever. I don't really give a crap, but it's 5.30 a.m. Aw, oh, man. Nah, thanks to Fio Higo, I woke up early for no reason. I should go back to sleep. Oh. Game! <laughs> huh? Huh? What was that sound? What was that What's noise? going on? <laughs> the earthquake? Hmm. This the earthquake. pressure. It did not feel like it shook. Hey, 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 hey! There's no way this building is gonna collapse, right? Hey. Hey, Kazuichi, stop clinging to me! <laughs> Handlebars! <laughs> and that's what happened. Hmm. I see. <laughs> I see! <laughs> so you're the one who was clinging to Fuyuhiko. That's obviously <laughs> wrong! <laughs> that, that's not the important part! <laughs> and what happened afterwards? Did you guys just separate? Hey! Alright, I gotta go. I gotta really, okay. really, really gotta go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, well. <sighs> um, should we wait for him? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's do that voice impersonation thing. Oh, yeah. We decided to wait things out, but in the end, nothing else happened. Oh, I got one. Uh-huh. Kiryu-chan! Kiryu-chan! 
We decided to wake things up, but in the end, nothing else happened. <laughs> I just, I just say kitty chant and I keep my voice like that and then begin talking. If I tried to do that voice, I'd probably have to say kitty chant before every sentence. Hey, Alex, are you there? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, can, you want to give us a, your own Fuyuhiko voice? So I started blasting. <laughs> 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 so anyways, I started blasting. <laughs> so anyways, I started blasting. <laughs> oh, uh, oh my god. Okay, okay, we'll read, read, read the sentence, put in your version of it. Oh yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> I don't want to do it. Back. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we are all doing <sighs> our own Flea Hiko voice. Basically, I can't. I wish. Oh well, I'll have to see this in the future. Yeah. Basically, I thought Fuyuhiko was Majima because of the eye patch. Yeah, Majima from and Majima. Because he was a yakuza. <laughs> and, and Alex, Alex said, Kiri Chan. Kiri Chan. And Alex, <laughs> Alex just said, uh, anyways, I started blasting, like, like, like Danny DeVito. Yeah, I had to. I, I had to do a Nekomaru, So. Oh man. Oh, oh, I see. Oh wow. I, 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 I sprint. <laughs> And I then, sprint marooed. Oh man. And everyone died. Yeah. <sighs> no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm good. Oh, wonderful. Like the bathroom be fine. I don't. Besides, it's not like my own. Anyway, it's enough of that bio talk. <laughs> Back to this. Sorry. <clears throat> we, <clears throat> we decided to wait things out, but it, in the end, nothing else happened. Also, and not just that, we all felt really weak, so we decided to just. Go back to our rooms for a while. Hmm. Hmm. I see. <laughs> yep. What you said just now was extremely important. Thanks to that, I've thought of one suspicious person. What? Yeah. <laughs> Who are you talking about? Excuse hey, me. Man, that red bean red is getting <laughs> It is good. very good. <laughs> me, of course. Me, of huh? course. Not me. I mean, isn't it strange? I was the only one who didn't notice the an alarm. That was so loud, everyone else came out of their rooms. Well, the same goes for the rumbling noise that you guys heard after that. Why, you? Hey, you better not be trying to confuse the shit out of us. Of course I'm not. For now. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! That, that for now line is making us even more worried. <laughs> Anyways, it seems there's no doubt that what you guys just told me is very important to me. <laughs> the wall clock alarm you heard first, and the rumbling noise that came right after. Now then, how do these noises relate to the case? Hmm. Uh, I'm very uh, lost. Uh, I'm so I'm very lost. I I, yeah, I, I but... love it. Anyways, all right. Yep, I get it now. Thanks to everyone detail, everyone's detailed information. I'm still getting a grasp of the situation. It was hurting me. <laughs> oh God, I feel a, a shock of accusation out of somewhere. <laughs> oh God damn it! If I put this in chrono events in chronological order. He could witness Nekomaru at 5 a.m. That's the time Nekomaru apparently went down to the first floor. At 5.30 a.m., the alarm clock in the lounge started ringing. When that happened, you two woke up and left your rooms to go to the lounge where Fuyuhiko was. Right after that, you heard a strange rumbling sound that didn't quite make sense. Let's make history. Now that I think about it, something must might have happened to Nekomaru during that noise. Yeah, smash. <laughs> if so, that must have been Nekomaru's final scream before he breathed his last. Robots don't mm. breathe, you imbecile. <laughs> yes. And it's hold on, hold on. If Nekomaru died when we heard that sound, doesn't that mean we have an Elabi? An Elabi? <laughs> Elabi? 
I mean... Why, we heard oh, we that heard rumbling. that! Oh, oh yeah, yeah, wait, yeah, it was me, yeah. <laughs> we heard that rumbling noise. We were at the lounge, you know. If that's when the killer murdered Nekomaru, when we, we, then we have a solid evil beat. Hmm. I get it. Can't argue with that! Hmm. It might be too soon to clear <clears throat> that just yet. Thinking to myself. <laughs> Can't be certain unless we first cleared up the mystery surrounding the rumbling noise. It's my tummy. <laughs> hmm. A, rum a rumbling noise, huh? Is something heavy fall or something? Also, based on what everyone's just told me, there's another thing I'm curious about. You all, <laughs> you all heard the alarm clock in the lounge go out just before the rumble. What do you suppose that means? Hmm. Well, somebody talking tried... to the general audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I don't it's know, Nagito. Thinking... <laughs> it's alright, teacher. <laughs> 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 oh my god. So, I feel like somebody's trying to make an alibi for themselves. Hmm. Hey, Ilibi. Hmm. Hey, haven't we talked enough? I really think I should repair the elevator so <laughs> Oh my, you're still here? <laughs> yeah, get back, back. <laughs> Once the elevator works, I'm not gonna let you anywhere near it. Bye. Hmm. And so Kazuichi ran down the stairs, complaining for some reason. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> so, uh, what should we do now? Uh, there's something I wanted you to do. What? After the elevator's fixed, there's something I want you to investigate. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what is it? The clock in the first floor lounge. Of both Grape House and Strawberry House. Right after that, you heard a strange rumbling sound that didn't quite make sense. Huh? Damn. Uh, why? I'll tell you later. Why didn't you tell me now? I don't know why. Fine. Why are you asking me? You can investigate that yourself. I've been investigating myself, but by the time the elevator is fixed, there's a chance I might not be with you all anymore. Cool. Huh? What? Huh? Anyway, I'm counting on you. Bye. <sighs> Bastard doesn't make any sense. I made the bagel of a sense. Wait, that that <laughs> bastard doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Neutral, please. <laughs> that, yeah, that's that is bastard. I, I read it as that bastard, so. Yeah, that is just... bastard, that's not make sense. <laughs> that is bastard. Now then, here comes the main event. I, I don't really all care right. about typos or anything, it's kinda cool. Alright, it all, it's all coming together. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one thing I can hey, do. Hey, it's too early, you dumbass! Oh. There's only one thing I can do for them. Oh, did he decide to choose to side with the killer? I can go to that place, for everyone's sake. Oh, okay. I can't let them face that danger. I must be the pariah who goes in their place. Bye! Hey, old man. Ah, uh, yes, Perch Reynolds. <laughs> hey, Perch Izuru Kamakura Reynolds. That's not me. Perch Izuru Kamakura Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> I understand why the school would be immortalized such an important person in the portrait. But why would he look like Birch Reynolds? <laughs> Just call him what? Beaker now. Yeah. Uh, Beaker. Yeah, Beaker. Yeah. But why would they put him in a place like this? What are they trying to show me? So what old. are you trying to tell me, Bert Reynolds? He he's the ultimate bagel master. <laughs> <laughs> you know that you handle the clocks. And also the cat <laughs> I mean clocks. <laughs> I know. I want you to thoroughly investigate the clocks in both houses and see if there's anything strange. Damn right! I really understand, but I might as well take care of that. Yeah, okay. It'd be funny if right. he set his view distance slightly higher than, uh, than yeah. Hajime. <laughs> it was. That's it. I should just get one more time before I head over there. The elevator and the door at the far back of the strawberry hut. Just in case, it might be a good to check and make sure they're really blocked up. Whoop de doop de doo. Oh yeah, uh, check your model pad. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's different. Okay. You don't you don't have access to Mustang. Hmm. That's the one small detail. 
And look, there's this hydro. Huh. Right. Into my room I go. Let's go into our room, Nagito. Okay, Nagito. <laughs> Wait, what if I just voiced the Nayagi in, Nag in Nagito's mind? <laughs> oh my god. Oh god, where am I? <laughs> Hello, hope inside my head. Oh god, oh god, where are you? Why are you so big? <laughs> I am the true messiah of hope inside <laughs> Oh god. Why do you look so much like me, except like a meth head? Why do you look like a midget? <laughs> <laughs> That's a second. Oh jeez. Ah, shattery power dead. <laughs> it's the strawberry hard door. Huh. Delicious. That needs to the tower. <laughs> but the button's broken. There's a way it will open. Yeah, as I recall, based on what Fujiko told Hajime over there on the phone, the other side of this door is barred chains. They must really they must have been really cautious to go to the trouble of barring the door from both sides. Something about this seems a little suspicious. Let's make history. The killer's intent. I can think of only one explanation. Ah, mech, Gundam. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Moriagate. <laughs> Perhaps they intended to keep me from entering the scene of the crime. Listen well. Which means the killer was afraid. Afraid of the conclusion promised by my assumptions. Yeah. That was probably it. Hmm. Thanks. Strawberry hog burning is the end to the truth for the checking of your handbook. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Hmm. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> if I press the button next to the elevator door, sh the door should open so I can ride it. But nothing's happened when I pressed it. Hmm, let me press it again. Hmm, nothing happened. It looks like it's broken. Hey, what are you doing? You're getting in the way of my repair. <laughs> I was waiting for him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, why did the elevator break in the first place? Man. Uh, oh, the killer malfunctioned the safety device. Look, you see the silver cover under the button? Looks like that's the elevator's control panel that probably opened it up and messed with the settings. But the cover is locked, so they wouldn't have been able to open it unless they had some kind of tool. Hmm. Are there any tools in this building? Uh, no, there shouldn't be. I don't really know if they forced it open with a tool anyway. The control panel on this, this side wasn't the one that was forced open. I see. It's a control panel on Crape House side that's broken then. Yeah. If the one on that side isn't broken, that's the only thing I can think of. I'm pretty sure there should be a control panel over there too. Plus, the elevator is stuck on the grape house. Hmm. Wouldn't that mean the last person who used this elevator went to grape house? Uh. Yep, it's official. The elevator was disabled on the other side. Hey! Hey, I don't have time to talk to you. Hurry up and go away. You. Jeez, I'm trying to do repairs with a tool and freaking you get here. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. If you don't have any tools, why don't you use this? Huh? What? The Nani? Whoa! Is this multi-tool? Where do you get something like this? I had it with me before I even arrived at the Fort Island. This store was really convenient. <laughs> if we're going to explore a new island, it's essential to bring the kind of equipment, right? right? You serious? A guy like you has been walking around with a dangerous tool this whole time. Yeah, I can shank you. <laughs> Huh? Is there something... something wrong? Ah... Uh, eh, it's nothing. Then I'll let you have this. Your repairs might go fast enough, eh? But in exchange, I want you to do something. Huh? Nani. The multi-tool has a compass. After the elevator is fixed, I want you to ride the elevator and see how the compass reacts. 
what the flippy for? Well, to be honest, that's something I still don't understand. Regarding the structure of this building. So please. I really need this information to find out the relationship between the building and the elevator. Huh? I don't get it, but well, as long as I'm just checking it. A compass I don't mind. I'm glad. Then I'll leave the rest to you. Bye. Hmm. Give me ah, I put this in. Elevated in my pocket. <laughs> it looks like it looks like the background you made for your recent most recent art. It does. <gasps> oh. Somewhat. Oh, oh yeah. Oh thank you. Just as I start thinking about that. Just as I start, there's no mistaking it. The elevator and strawberry hall door look like they're completely broken. I didn't expect the contact elevator to be disabled from Grave House. As long as it's disabled, there's no way to move between houses. Which means the person who disabled the elevator would be stuck at Grape House. That person, they should still be at Grape House, but... No, it's too soon to form an answer. Oh, there's a call. phone call. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I said it's a phone call. Other oh, Nagito, keep up the investigation! Wait, how does he have a phone? That store is really convenient. <laughs> but there's no cell phone towers. Yes, but we forgot about the electronic alleyway. <laughs> <sighs> That's right. <laughs> it's really funny. Meet more. I did Nagito, I'm coming back, Nagito! Yeah, okay. I'm back, Nagito. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Press the button, fiend. It's too soon to form an answer. But I won't be too late to find the answer even after I finish the investigation. That room. Investigating that room. That Time room. To play some saw. Also, Gundam. That room. Yes. Time. Do the do do for Nekumba. <laughs> <laughs> this is a bathroom, but there's nothing here that catches my eye, so I should leave it alone. <laughs> okay. Be gone, Komi. Oh, actually, I haven't yeah. talked to him yet. Yeah, you haven't talked to him. This too must be the will of causality. Indeed. The will of causality. Indeed. I can think of only one reason why the killer barred the door to the sh strawberry hall. They wish to prevent me from going to the crime scene. <laughs> to prevent me. Judgment! <laughs> <laughs> Which means the killer was afraid. Afraid of the conclusion promised by my assumptions. <laughs> I don't get it, but it sounds tasty. Silence, Komi. Okay. Yow. Yes, it is time. Hello, TFDR. Hello! It's me! Bouncy the Clown! It's FDR. Yeah, dude. FDR. My president. <laughs> <laughs> Only those who win the life when the game contained within will reach the... Uh... Uh... uh I don't know my shapes. <laughs> Nagito has problems reading his own thoughts in his brain. <laughs> Bagels. But... <laughs> but not round-ish. <laughs> The inside of the Octodigan. The ultimate weapon awaits, as I say out loud. <laughs> There's no doubt Nekomon's killer has been to the that place. No matter where I search, there are no weapons anywhere in this building. Regardless of the weapon used to kill Nekomaru, the killer must have obtained it here. The dead. If that's the case, I should get going. Also, unlike everyone else, I don't mind dying after all. <laughs> That's all the more reason why I should go. Oh, enter within this, my sanctum! This makes me think of something. When I get back out of here, I need to remember to record the next airing of My Little President Can't Be This Cute. <laughs> oh, jeez, this is freaky. Oh, it's an escape room! Oh, no! Uh, I see, so this is the final bedroom. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Feels a little eerie. I hope. Hope. <laughs> I don't get scared. <laughs> ah, I see you've entered the uh -oh. final dead room. <laughs> Clack. Oh. Huh, did the door just locked? Hmm. I see. The door is designed to automatically be locked. It's not I would have turned back if I stayed unlocked. Uh oh. 
I thought the door finally opened! Now it's locked again! He's been trapped in- oh my god. No. Hmm. Da da da. I figure you turn up since I haven't seen you in a while. I never expected to see you here. Eh? Yeah? Nagito? Huh? Why are you in such a dangerous place? Same, same to you. Why are you here? I- Excuse me. Yeah, excuse me. I- I heard the body discovery announcement, and I thought something happened in this room! And you got locked in when you came inside. You're a fool from the toe. From head to toe. <laughs> I'm truly ashamed! Dang it, I cannot unsee it now. <laughs> the whole- the whole tears are the eyes and the freaking eyes are the eyes. Dang it. Anyways, well, not that I care. I just just make sure you don't get in my way. Um, get in your way. The light burning game is going to start soon, right? It'd be annoying if you get in my way. It's time to do. <laughs> uh, are you are you planning to do it? Yeah, lay down on the bed. I'll give you a massage. <laughs> Where have I been? <laughs> What have I done? I can't get out of here, right? That's the final step in here. The true challenge. And besides, the only way the only way trash like me can be useful is risking my life. For everyone's sake. For everyone's That's sake. That's wrong! <laughs> You're wrong! Nagito is not trash at all! Then I'm a bagel! <laughs> There's no such thing as a human being who doesn't deserve to live! <gasps> I know I'm being hard for me right now, but my heart is super scared of people like crazy! What the hell? Are you sure about that? <laughs> Are you sure? You're not just excited? You know, isn't it exciting to think that I can finally be useful for the sake of those who shall shoulder hope? Now then. About this so-called life-threatening game. Oh boy. Here we go. Alrighties! Nagito, if there's anything you don't get, just ask me! By all means, I'll help you and make sure you get out of here! Leave it to me! Be it on! It's escape time! That's not like something a teacher would say, but I shouldn't expect too much from her. Also, also like, I, I, I remember this, but there was an option for this game uh -huh. where you can skip this entirely. Of course. It's like, it's like, you're taking too long. Oh, wait, I'm taking too long? No, 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 no. Uh -huh. I mean, no. No, the game. It's oh. like, it's like this escape game, you know? It's oh, like, yeah. It reminds, me of, it reminds me of the escape room I did with Vector. Oh, that's so cool. There's something written in blood in the, at the back. The um. Looks like the number five! Hmm, these split symbols alone don't make sense, but maybe if I combine them with something else. Red five! <gasps> Standard five, five. Five, five! This is gold leader. This is blue leader. Yeah, it says watch the news and blood. <laughs> I might get cursed just by looking at it! Yeah, it's just a C code. Plus, it's a pretty common one. Hmm? Ah? Secret code? Now you know, do you happen to know what this means? Nope. Yeah, it's a common riddle. Apparently I do. Hmm. Doesn't matter. That looks like a butt. <laughs> There's something written in the blood on the wall. Hmm. Looks like it's the number three. Blood symbols alone don't make sense. Blah 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 blah. I know this. My brain can work. Let's do this. For <laughs> if I combine it with something else, hmm, it can do it. Hmm. Now you know, we have a problem. These iron bars are completely blocking the door. As long as we don't do something about these bars, we won't be able to escape from this room. Yeah, here it is. Oh. For those of you who have no interest in playing an escape game, I prefer a shortcut. 
what would you like to do? Would you like to take a shortcut and bypass the escape game? Though? No! Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, We're not losers! Awesome. I want an achievement. Alter ego! Huh, why is there a little midget? <laughs> yeah, it's a laptop. Looks like it looks like it's on, but it's locked, so I can't really access it. Hmm. It doesn't look like you can input the password. How are you gonna turn it on? By turning it off. Huh? <laughs> this must be a locked device for the iron bars. I probably have to put it in the four-digit password. No problem. I have a secret plan. If you input nine 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 combinations, it'll open eventually. Great idea. You're right. <laughs> but there's. <laughs> <laughs> but there don't seem to be any buttons for inputting a password. <laughs> it looks like it might be under this lid, but it doesn't seem to open. Yeah, not just that. What's this red light that's on top of this device? Deep, deep, deep. I see. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ah! Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Bro, what are you talking about? Nine. Huh, there's something written on the blood. Um... <laughs> it's it's the, wall. the number six! Yeah, These yes. Bloods? Yes. Okay. It's... It's the wall that's written on the blood. Hmm. Yeah, look, TV! <sighs> it's broken. Ah, uh, sorry. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, yeah, like after we finish this, then we'll it'll be just stopping point. Yeah. Mm hmm. Hmm. There's something written on the book. Seven. Hmm. Yeah, it's gonna um, be the same dialogue. I yeah. can see the number six. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm, yes. It all, it's all coming together. <laughs> I'm huh. seeing all sixes now. It won't. It's locked. It won't open. <laughs> Let me open it. Hmm. It's open, but it won't lock. Oh, nipple pliers! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, finally! <laughs> I've been missing those! I was wondering where I put them! Oh. Eh, yeah, pliers, huh? These might be useful, too, so I should grab one. You grab it. I hmm. oh, have pink pliers. Ooh. Hmm. Ooh, hello. Hmm, this looks like some kind of password. I got it! Yes. The five letters of the days of the weeks are probably the password! What? Hm. I it's that simple. I thought it's that simple. Three! <laughs> yes. Hmm. Huh, there's something written in blood on the floor. Um, Is this a number? <laughs> right? <laughs> yes. A number, huh? It looks... Like a different symbol to me. <laughs> I was reading it upside down, so. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a satanic ritual going on. <laughs> like, for instance, a symbol that you often see on maps. Mm. Yeah, he's giving me the key. Huh. Wait a minute. So, north, east, south. Ew. Anyways, it's a Monokuma push. You want me to punish you guys? You guys want me to punish you? Okay. <gasps> it looks like this pushy talks when you squeeze his tummy! Thrills! Chills! Kills! It's not size Monokuma enough. Now for the special price of only a $10,000. Hula! Hula! You know, advertisement? Finally! <laughs> something bright. Ew, something shiny. Under the bed is the boogeyman. Huh. Hmm, I can't reach it. Looks like the bed is fixed to the floor. I can't even move it. Uh, by the way, is this time? No, okay. it's not time. Uh... You see a timer. Okay. Yeah. Is there something thin and long? Maybe. Hmm. Yeah, it's obviously been positive uses. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. Okay, I see. Okay, my bad. Can I? Okay. Yeah. Uh... Watch the news. Hmm. Okay, so let's say starting north. 
so it would be three, nine, seven, wait, three, nine, seven, Oh, Oh look, a coating! Huh. Oh, bye coating. <laughs> you didn't actually touch the coating, by the way. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, this was also a four-digit code, huh? It looks like you can change the numbers with this one. Alrighty! This time around, let's try the nine 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 nine, nine combinations! Good idea! <laughs> I'll leave that in mind this work to you, Monami. <gasps> oh, I'll decline that as well. Yeah, the password are open this. I have a feeling that the hint is close by. It's obvious where they are. Yeah, yeah. it's 9999999 the password! If there was like one more one more like digit to input, it would have been 11037. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I should try and put in something. Oh. Oh, how interesting. Hmm. Okay, so... If you don't get this right, it'll blow up. I'm joking. <laughs> I'll blow up and act like I don't know nobody. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, wait, hold on. <laughs> That's not what I want to do yet. Co-Tanger. <laughs> Time to be a pirate. This is one code hanger in the car. Shiver me tippers! It might be useful for something, so I should grab it just in case. Oh, there we are. A team code hanger. Mm. Hey, nerd. Bye. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hmm, mm. there's something shiny and mm. uh, I can't reach it. Let's see, it's made out of wire. Interesting. So I can't do anything with them just yet? You can. It's just that you haven't figured it out. Okay, gotcha. Haha! -ha! Okay, so. Think about it. Try... Interesting. Think about it. Hmm? His brain is half dead, don't worry. It's alright. Oh! Oh, okay, I see. <laughs> but... <laughs> I don't know how the controls work for this, for a keyboard. I have played this on the console. Like, oh, okay, sure. you have to do spacebar. <laughs> uh, <sighs> oh, wait, no. Never mind. Uh, yeah, I mean, we have the control menu for Yeah, the... okay. Sorry, my bad. I didn't know that was a That's thing. That's fine. Yeah, okay. That's Medical, fine. cursor, top, left mouse button, set item. Oh, set item. Okay, okay, so it works like that type of thing. Uh, the final dead room controls. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have a magic wand. Oh. Now the Kazam. Okay. Uh. Oh, that's the game. There we are. Expect the patrol. Alright, that's the key. Maybe we can escape with this, Nagito. Who knows? I see. Okay. My nose are yours. <laughs> Finally, something to stab myself with. <laughs> Anyways, ah, scissors. Oh wait, no, that's you. <laughs> oh shit, sorry. <laughs> yeah, ah, scissors. If we use these to cut the iron bars. You're joking, right? Or is that supposed to be an indirect hint? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hmm. Find the to kill. Yeah, there's oh, something okay. oh, okay. in there. Nice, nice job. Oh. All right, let's try cutting it open. Enough already! Yeah, don't eat my, don't eat grannies. Oh. I didn't eat grannies. <laughs> what a loud thing! Cut it right open. Yes, murder. <laughs> yeah, so there was something. Batteries. Double A batteries. Oh. Teen the better. Oh god, it was hollow. Okay. Watch the news. They say you'll be oh. fine. They say. Excuse me, hold on. Let's, uh... 
Yeah, this says it's broken. I don't think it's bad anymore. I don't think this will be handy. Yeah, a laptop. Uh, There's luck, so it can't be access. Okay. Oh, I can move it around like this. How weird. Okay. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Okay, let's try my, my, my theory. So this is like a compass. This will be north. So three, nine, since the line is at the top. Three, nine, seven, Yourself. Feel free to ask me anytime. Hmm. Yeah, Monami is like the big hint. Okay. Like, well, she'll just give you hints. Okay. <laughs> Safe as a tuppy. Did you find out Nagito? No. The numbers on the wall are definitely the password for the safe. I just need to look at those numbers by the. Oh. Uh, yep. <clears throat> Okay. Yeah! News, north, east, west, south. I see! Okay. Yeah, <laughs> it's really simple. I'm a genius! So, three, five... Uh, north, north so, mm -hmm. east... Okay, so... Three... Three, nine... Nine... Five... Five... Seven. Three, nine, seven. Five, seven. Yeah! Ah, yes, news. Let's see. Three, nine, five, seven days. There we are. Ooh, shiny. Huh. Hmm, that digital camera and your US USB stick. Hey, it's not it's my camera. <laughs> Wait, that's not my camera. Hey, thanks for it, tomato. <laughs> Ten digital camera. Hmm, looks like there's no batteries inside the digital camera. Well, I wonder what I should do there. Hmm, hmm. Yeah. Yeah, these batteries on the digital camera? Question mark? Hmm. Yes. Now we can use the digital camera. Fine. Hmm. Good fit. Alright. Uh, the USB screen. Oh, what? Oh. As I thought, looks like I was able to unlock the uh, unlock, unlock the lock with the USB stick. Now I just need to input the password. Maybe the memo that was inside the desk drawer might be the laptop's password. I got it. It's the first letters of the days of the week. Monday, Tuesday, T. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. WTF. MTWTFS. Ding! What? He was wrong! He does, it's that simple. Hmm. What? It's just that you haven't used it. Haven't used it, okay. Uh, this can. Oh, okay. check your sister doesn't say. Uh, oh. It looks like a photo of a space poster that's posted on. Ah! S -M -P -E -N -G. S -P -E -N -G. Yeah, space. Hmm, I wonder what it means. Spicy. Hmm. All right. Well then. Uh, next case. I I'll, I I can do. I can tell you. Okay. Oh. 
Okay. Mm, based on the and, memo. Okay, alright, never mind. <laughs> based on the memo and the picture in the digital camera, the answer must be. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, how, how interesting. Okay, hold on. Oh, wait, the, how, uh, how, how does this work? The little bracket right there uh, is like the uh, delete. Let me uh, see. Okay. The, yeah. little, the, the, the backspacing. The, yeah, the little angle symbol. Yeah, yeah it's the backspace. I'm just trying to figure out like what's moving it. It's just moving on its own. What? Yeah, oh wait. Oh yeah, it does. It does. What? Huh. Uh, okay. Huh? I think. Are you sure it's moving on its own? I don't remember if it does do that. Huh? What? I don't remember it moving on its own. Wait, what Use the a WASD key or the mouse pad. What? What the hell? Did Controls? It... <laughs> Did... Back, backspace? Nope. Okay. Uh... Can you bring anything up? Uh, no. I'm pressing F1 and escape. R. Oof. Oh god. Okay. Um. Well, that's. What about the mouse? Uh, yeah, no. Oof. And then, well, we didn't save. Yeah, we did. Suck. Yeah, no, we didn't. We weren't expecting this because we don't have problems like this typically. All right, so maybe we can end it here, and then I'll play right up to this point, and we can continue after that. Yeah. <laughs> Next time. Sure. Yeah, might as well. Okay, gotcha. All right. What a what a what a weird thing. I hold on because, well, maybe it's because. Don't edit yet. Uh huh. Are you using a controller? No. Or are you using a keyboard? Uh, he's using mouse and keyboard. I played it on the controller. That's a different stuff. Does it work with a controller on Steam? Oh. Yes. Uh, oh, okay. Yes, it does. Overlay. Try using a controller just in case. A, yeah, do you have like a oh, yeah, Xbox? Here. Uh, yeah, let me grab one. We have to utilize all of them. Yeah, my, my uh, keyboard set is up to Japanese. Japanese. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna look this up if this is like a common glitch. Yeah. Oh, it is. Oh. Final Dead Room keyboard bug. Hello, I have a problem with Final Dead Room. At some point, there is a password to type on the keyboard, but really, uh. Oh. Hmm. Nah. No, that's not the same bug. It's like they said, like, the M disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh. Uh, here, I can't things. spell mac and cheese anymore. <laughs> Since I, oh, I finished the game, was, the game just crashed. Oh. Uh, you know that makes okay. more sense. That makes more sense than uh, anything else. Okay. Yeah. Well, now we now we just need to save before we when we come to this room or get to it. So uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, I'm gonna stop the recording and then I'm just gonna play up to that point and just skip all the dialogue. <laughs> so uh, mm -hmm. I'll stop now.